tell us what we want or we will beat you. You might as well tell us now and save yourself. Would we be in here a day, a year? Were our lives in danger? Ebbing prison, the dreaded hell hole of Tehran was now our church. Our book is called Captive in Iran. It is our story of being unjustly sentenced to Ebin, one of the most notorious prisons in Iran, for our Christian faiths. Furthermore, it is about the violations of human rights and the story of many women who were the victims of the Iranian government. The day that uh, we got arrested, uh, I got a call from a stranger in the morning. Uh, he had uh, some uh, question about uh, my car documents and asked me to go to the police station. They took all my documents, handcuffed me, and they told me that uh, uh, you are under arrest of uh, being a Christian and evangelizing. We were afraid. For all we knew, this could be our last day on earth. We held hands and prayed to the Lord to calm our hearts. Our greatest fear was that we would break and say things out of His will. We prayed for strength. We wanted our captors to see we were confident and brave. If we are tortured, give us the power to stand fast in our faith. There are people in prison that, that nobody can hear their voices and they need our help and we promised some of our friends in prison to be a voice for them. We must be responsible for those who are in persecution and participate in their uh, suffering. We, we are sure that God had a plan for many women there. And as we were talking to them and you know, we praying for them, we, we, we could see the changes in their lives and it was so encouraging for us and it was a great impact in our lives.